Attention passengers, we've now reached our destination. We hope you enjoyed the flight and have a nice day. Welcome back to my channel and for today's vlog we're going to talk about the teeth requirement of the cabin crew. Since a, lot of, since a lot of you are asking me and messaging me, private message, comments and all, so now your, answer, your questions will be answered today. Welcome to Jealous Styles PH. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe. My vlogs are about travel, beauty, and flight attendant topics. So if you're ready, we'll start! Okay guys, so before we start, I'll just give a disclaimer since not every airline has the same policy. So these informations are about my knowledge and my research, about my experience. Let's start! Some of you are asking if braces are allowed well basically no it's not allowed in most of the airlines some of them they will ask you to remove it before you start the training or at least before you start flying or after the training but basically most airlines they don't allow you to fly with braces next is veneer so a lot since a lot of you are asking me uh, if veneers are allowed, well, yes, veneers are allowed. If you don't know veneers, I'll show you a picture here, a sample of veneers. We're in the grinder to put a fake teeth, and most of the actress or beauty queens can use these veneers to have a very visible smile or to have a bigger tooth or to set of teeth. And yes, it's allowed. This is eye curl lamination as well. It's almost the same as veneers, so yes, it's allowed. I have seen a lot of questions as well and they're asking me if pasta is allowed. Well, yes, pasta is allowed. This is how you need to fix your um, decaying tooth, right? So yes, you need to fix your tooth before start flying. And also the impacted tooth, you need to remove them before you start flying or else you'll have a hard time. If it hurts, it can really hurt that much if you started flying and you didn't remove your impacted tooth and you need to go on leave and your face will swell so some of you are asking as well that if you have like a model kind of set of teeth like those with gaps you know well of course it's allowed but if you have like a missing tooth then that's the time that it's not allowed okay and you can either maybe do an implant or fixed bridge or dental bridge to cover that up. Especially if it's in the front where they can see when you smile. Next question that I have been receiving. Um, they are asking me if dentures are allowed or the false teeth. Well, the normal ones, like uh, the one that can be removed, well, I think it's not allowed since since retainers are not also allowed or braces. So I assume that dentures are not allowed as well since it can be removable and you know what I mean. And yeah, I think the airlines are just being sensitive about it. Yeah, uh, those uh, aspirants that have asked me about the dentures I always suggest them maybe they can do implant or fixed bridge if it's not a lot of tooth some of you might ask as well like if you have sunki or you don't have a beautiful set of teeth what can you do or if you have like an overlapping kind of set of teeth if it's allowed I actually have seen some of the crew but it's not that the uh, intense or it doesn't look that bad so i think they allow those but still the dentist of the company will say if it's okay or not or maybe you can make it removed or in tagalog we call it sunki right you can also remove that if you can till the discretion of the company and they will ask you to do check up with their dentist so don't worry about it so yeah guys thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video and you've learned something and if you have any questions please do let me know in the comment below and i will answer them for you thank you okay guys on my next videos i will talk about other requirements of being a flight attendant like about skin requirements height requirements and 
school requirements for the degree if you need or not so just stay tuned so if you don't want to miss it do subscribe to my channel now and hit the like button and also the bell button so at least you will be notified once I upload new videos. <laughs> so yeah, that's it for today guys and I hope you like the video. And if you have any more questions, just leave up in the comments. So yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. Once again, thank you so much for watching my video and I hope you like it. And if you do, please do subscribe and be a FA Diary fam as well. And if you have any questions, please do leave a message at my Instagram account.